All right, let's begin the, the hands-on lab or the configuration section. And um, the very first uh, thing that we'll be doing as a part of unit one exercise is uh, setting up or creating a new online store um, uh, in commerce headquarters. So for that, uh, I'll go to my commerce headquarters. Uh, for uh, logging into your commerce headquarters, uh, you should be uh, in your LCS environment. And from there you can access uh, your uh, environment, the test environment there where you would be getting out this uh, hands-on lab and uh, there uh, through, uh, through lcs you could log into your environment so once you are in the uh, environment make sure you are in the usrt company which is the retail demo data company for us now um, <clears throat> once i am in my commerce headquarters i'm gonna search for online stores and this would open up uh, the online store farm and this is where i would be creating the new online store so i'm going to click new and if you are uh, following um, uh, the hands-on live guide uh, the pdf file then you need to be uh, starting from page number 16 and the guide is also having all the details along with the screenshots and the steps in detail so let's give it a name, the new store, uh, Adventure Vox, and I'm going to just call it B2C. Um, as you can see over here, this drop down by default says B2C because by default, any online store that you create is B2C, unless you specifically specify it to be the B2B, and um, then it serves as a B2B store. And we'll be covering the B2B components and the separate leg of Commerce Academy, which is focused on B2B. So we're gonna leave it at B2C in the uh, warehouse. We're going to select um, US uh, Central. So let's select US. Uh, oh, sorry, it's I think called DC Central. DC Central and in the time zone you can select any time zone that's applicable I'm choosing Pacific time and I'm gonna choose 10,002 customer in the customer address book uh, we are selecting USRT Central and and email notification profile we are going to choose en profile as you can see by default language en us has already been populated so we're gonna click um, save so once this is saved you would be able to add a payment account or a payment connector to your online store so we have a bunch of different uh, payment connector options available adian apple google paypal so uh, whichever um, payment connector that uh, your company has a test account with you could use that for your uh, demo purposes um, so I'm not gonna fill this up you could do that later on so it's not a mandatory step but uh, for example uh, if you want to do any online transactions like for example in uh, as a part of this uh, commerce academy we need to do end-to-end uh, -end, uh, uh, scenario of buy online and pick up in store so in order to complete that you would need to have access to a test payment uh, connector so with that, that uh, completes uh, uh, the setup of uh, online store and we'll move to the next lab.